Can you believe it? Can you believe that it is finally Christmas? It's here again. It is Christmas time. And if you know me at all, you know that mid-November, like it is right now, is far too late for me to just be getting started on Christmas. I am one of those, it is November 1st, it is Christmas kind of people. And yeah, I can't believe it's taken me this long. So if you haven't caught on, I'm about to start decorating for Christmas today. Before I get into the fun part though, there are a few things that need to be done that are less fun. I need to do a little bit of cleaning because who wants to put decorations up on filth, right? That's not good. And I need to make a final decision regarding that desk. So that corner is where my Christmas tree normally goes. And since last Christmas, I got a desk and put it there. So I'm trying to decide what to do. I think the Christmas tree still needs to go there. It's just the perfect Christmas tree spot. So I might move the desk where Rory is but I'm afraid it's gonna stick too far out into the floor and block the Christmas tree's view, or the view of the Christmas tree from certain places in the apartment. So I'm gonna have to play with it a little bit. The sun just really encroached on my territory, huh? Wow. Okay, so I'm looking at it from the other side of the couch now, and I think it's gonna work as long as we pull the tree out a little bit so that it's kind of in front of that long, thin window there rather than pushed all the way back. Ross is back, and he is about to retrieve the goods from Great Heights. I was trying to film a montage of all of this happening and it filmed for like 20 seconds and then cut off without my noticing. So um, we fluffed the tree to this point. The thing kept cutting me off, so I hope those montages were good. If you couldn't tell, the tree is fluffed. It's got some lights on it, so let's plug it in and see if the lights work. I feel like this makes me hold my breath every year. It's half the time they don't work. No! So like, do we just need to tighten it? So if you guys didn't know, it is string of lights sometimes if one is out it causes more to go out and if you push on them you can maybe fix it well this really isn't good we can't go much further without getting some new lights unless he can fix them right now i think our christmas dish towel looks stained that's definitely not vibey. Why is it insane? I guess we gotta go get some lights. Why didn't one of y'all tell us to test the lights before we put them on the tree? It's not your fault. I can't believe you guys, but that was stupid. This happens like every year. Why didn't we, why? Does this happen to you guys every year? Okay, so I'm gonna be going out in a little while to buy some new lights for the tree, but until then, I guess I'll just sit a few of our other things around. I don't really have a whole lot of a plan and I feel like I need to get a lot more things. Like I actually don't have 
that much stuff. And I saw some really cute decorations at Five Below the other day. They just put a Five Below in near where I live, so I might go by there when I go to get lights and see what I can find, but let me get started. So I feel like if that desk is really gonna live right by the tree like that, that it needs to be decorated. And I don't really have adequate things to decorate all of those shelves. So I definitely need to figure out something for there. Guys, you're never gonna believe this. I was just about to go out and buy more lights and then Rory jumped up in the tree and shook it and the lights came on. So no, I don't have to go buy more lights. <laughs> Ross is just adjusting the lights so that they're spaced more evenly, but it looks like we are back in business. Later. Hello everyone. It has been a minute since we last spoke it's like 9 p.m. now, and unfortunately we had to put a pause on the Christmasing because we don't have like a full day to dedicate to just preparing for Christmas. I like so wish we did, and we could, but if we were going to do that, we would have to wait until like after Thanksgiving probably, and that's just not in the cards for me. Like I said, it's already late for me. So stopped doing Christmas, did some other things that I have to do, and now we're getting very much in the Christmas spirit. We have been drinking some champagne. I have ordered insomnia cookies, and now is the moment. We are gonna decorate this Christmas tree. I'm so excited that we managed to fix the lights, or rather Rory managed to fix the lights by doing something she's not supposed to do. We've also since sprayed uh, anti-scratch spray on the tree that we have for the couch and hopefully that'll keep her out of it but i'm not optimistic okay before we get into the decorating i just wanted to show you guys my things so most of these things are from target but not this year but you know maybe they still have something similar i said it's all from target but then the first thing i pick up the tree skirt is from amazon but this is the tree skirt it's white and it's fluffy and it looks like snow and it's my favorite thing <laughs> honestly. Uh, this is my star. I kind of hate it, to be honest with you. It's cute here in my hands, but I feel like it needs to show up better on the tree. These pine cones are really, really cute. The theme of my tree, the color theme, I guess, is like shades of gold. So rose gold, regular gold, silver. I guess that's not shades of gold. That's like metal, right? Metal? Sure. And I also have white icicles. They're sparkly, I don't know if you can tell. I would love to say that I store my ornaments nicely, but they're in a trash bag. But yeah, this is kind of the base of the colors here. So you've got silver, rose gold, and there are sparkly ones, matte ones, shiny ones. They're great. And all stuck together. Amazing. Oh, this Santa is an ornament, but I don't use it as one. I just sit it somewhere usually because it doesn't match my tree. So I've got this music note ornament. Oh, I love this. This is a 2020 gingerbread man, which is broken, you know, in homage to 2020. And then these little gnomes that my cousin made last year. <laughs> They're so cute. Okay, I think that's it. Let's do some decorating. The cookies arrived just in time. The ornaments are on and it's time. Do 
Oh, for sure. It's the next evening. I just got out of work and I'm going to buy a few things. I'm not really sure what entirely, but we'll see. quick little haul of the things I got. I spent roughly $40 in Five Below and then $10 in Target. All of it's from Five Below except one thing and I'll, I'll point that out. So first of all, do I have any idea what a disco ball has to do with Christmas? No, but I absolutely needed it. It's so shiny. So then here's my one Target purchase. $10 for these little guys. And I'm gonna show you why I had to have them. So at five below, I got a ton of these trees. And I just think that the little deer are gonna be so cute wandering around in the trees. I'm thinking this could be a good option for the desk area up here. But yeah, I just, I got, I went really rogue on these trees. This is a medium one and a small one, so they come in three different sizes, like that. So I got uh, several different colors. So I got the pink ones in every size, I got the white ones in every size, I got these two dark green ones, I got a medium size and a little light green one. Oh my gosh, there's like fake snow and glitter going everywhere. <laughs> I got this. Tree. It's a glass tree for the bathroom because I don't have anything decorating the bathroom and I just wanted a little something in there and I feel like you can put this on the sink and not have to worry about it getting wet. Last, I just got these little string lights to put, I'm thinking in the bedroom around the bed frame, I think. We'll see though. So see, this is what it's looking like in here right now. Trash bags and things just kind of aimlessly placed everywhere so that's the next job but the tree oh she's looking stunning two days later <laughs> somebody likes the disco ball it is now two days after the last clip you saw and this will be the final day of this video it has to be i am set on getting my decorating finished today. It's honestly obnoxious how long this is taking considering that I really don't have that many decorations. Why is real life like this? I hate real life. I just wanna decorate. I just want a, a whole day to decorate. Such is not life, but let's finish it up right now. a good time to interrupt myself because I thought this video would be a good one for me to clarify what my holiday YouTube plans are for this year. So if you've been around since last year, you know that last year I did Vlogmas and I posted a vlog every single day of December leading up until Christmas. Unfortunately, <laughs> I just do not have the bandwidth to do that this year. I'm very sorry, I would love to. I really enjoyed doing Vlogmas, but it is a ton of work and I just can't manage it this year on top of everything else I have going on. However, 
you know I can't go from doing a full-fledged vlogmas to not doing anything special for the holidays. So in the month of December, I will be posting twice a week instead of once a week. I will be posting on Tuesdays and Saturdays. There will be a lot of good Christmas content in there in addition to some regular content if you're not all about the Christmas stuff like I am. So yeah, I wish I could do Vlogmas again. I'm sure it's in the cards sometime in the future. Last year will not be my only Vlogmas. But for this year, I hope you enjoy two videos a week. Now would be a great time for you to subscribe to see all that nice Christmas content. And uh, yeah, back to your regularly scheduled programming. <laughs>